Gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, a catchweight contest of 30 minutes, six five-minute rounds, two fall, two submissions or a knockout to the winner. Introducing on my left from Portsmouth in hands, Bob Cutquad. And his opponent from Lewisham in London, Bobby Barnes. Bobby Barnes, who never gets uh, too much of a, a hand. And he enters the ring simply because he takes so long to get down to the first round. The folding of the dressing gown generally uh, even has a hanger with him. Oh, this time a fold, yes. But no comb. So here we go for round one of the main catchweight contest here this afternoon at the center halls walking between Bob Kirkwood of Portsmouth at 14-6, a mid-heavyweight, and Bobby Barnes at 13-6. So exactly one stone in this, Bobby Barnes for once giving away more than just a few pounds. He's going to have some problems, I should think, doing it with Bob Kirkwood against him. Joe Duracy. The third man in the ring, and two falls to decide this one. It's a lovely quick reverse work. Barnes may be uh, a bit of a showman when he comes in with that flashy gown and the hair and everything, but. He certainly can wrestle. And he can use the ropes legitimately too. Neat grapevine hook there by Barnes. Jerk would have no idea where that came from at all. It didn't last, but it was a neat move, very seldom seen. Kirkwood not particularly worried what Barnes is actually doing at the moment. It's what he's going to do next. Oh. I don't expect he expected that any more than we did at ringside here. So the fairly hefty leg spread that Barnes can't get up from without help from his hands. <laughs> got the back hammer on by using his leg only there Barnes he really is trying a few tricks here today <laughs> so got nicely but didn't hold it firmly enough Kirkwood got the counter in with that head scissors Even now, Barnes trying for the pinfall from that position. <laughs> Take a little more chance. Right, Joe, and to the referee by his Christian name. Seldom heard. 
Just one minute left in round one. Spin. Two, three, four, five, six. And Kirk would tall, tall enough to make this one count. Just ten seconds to go. The Omni Rip against the joint over the shoulder. With a taller man operating it, always dangerous. But right on the bell. Very seldom you see Bobby Barnes smile, actually. It's the second time so far this afternoon since in one round. But he's actually forced a grin. Oh, water. Now, oh, that's a new one. But still no comb yet so far. Very unusual, this. The comb is very quickly. Seconds away, round two. Barnes ready to go for round two. Kirkwood, amused look on his face in his uh, own corner there as the, as the toweling operation was going on there. A two fall bout, remember. Two falls, two submissions or a knockout. Beside this winner, five rounds to go. Barnes, blonde head, Lewisham wrestler in the white trunks. This is Bob Kirkwood of Portsmouth. is on finally took him quite a time to get it and the double arm releasing the feet now trying to turn his man back to canvas in preparation for a possible pinfall attempt of course Price has got an extra stone Kirkwood might Possibly do this. He won't bridge for too long under 14 6, I don't think. Oh, quick, but not even trying it. Vine's a little bit lucky to get away with that. Nicely out by Kirkwood, proving he can uh, escape pretty fast too. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Press. Yes, nicely if he can hold it. No, not quite. Kirkwood, a wee bit too strong for him, but a good effort. But the lighter man there. 